Hi everyone, welcome to my Autodesk screencast. My name is Zan Ta and I work for Repo Products in Smyrna, Georgia. I'm an Autodesk certified instructor and hold many certifications in multiple Autodesk products for the AEC industry. I hope you enjoy my screencast. If you'd like to see more of my screencast, please search for VAR 2015, that's V-A-R 2015, or my name. Please don't forget to give me a thumbs up after you watch it. In today's screencast, we'll be taking a look at AutoCAD architecture and how to insert doors and windows inside a AutoCAD architecture wall. Here I am in model space. I can select the wall command to place walls. And I want to put in doors and windows. I can click the door command or the window command. From here, I can pick the wall and I can place it. Now, if it starts to jump like this for you, that means that the properties of the door is forcing it to sit in a certain position. So we can go to properties and go over here where it says um, position along wall. I'm going to leave it as unconstrained for now. Now I can place it wherever I want. Same thing with windows. Start the command, go to properties, specify whether you want it constrained or not constrained, and place it accordingly. Uh, if you need to, verify your units and make sure it's set to what you want. And now when I put in a door or a window, again, go to properties, and then specify whether you want it to be an offset, say six inches, for example, and it will automatically place it. You also can go to the design tab or the tool palette and start the door command here or the window command here to do the same thing. If you need to put in more styles of doors or windows, you can right click the commands and go to that particular object. The reason we have this situation is because when you put in start the door or window command and you go to properties, in the style that's listed, you can change it. But if this list is short, that means that the style of the door or the style of the window has not been loaded yet. So go ahead and start the command again, but right click first and go to door style or window style. You'll get into the style manager. Here on the left hand side it lists the current drawing that you're in. You can open up from your library uh, the door styles file or the window styles file. That is located under C Drive, Program Data, Autodesk, AutoCAD 2016 or the version you're running. ENU, Styles, Imperial. And so if I were to select all of this, copy this, um, well, better yet, we'll just go to U and Desktop, Computer, C, Program Data, Autodesk, AutoCAD Architecture 2016, ENU styles imperial here you'll see door styles and you'll also see window styles so pick the one you want to work with here we're working with door style so I'll select that I'll hit open now that door style family that door style file is now listed in the style manager I can go and I can drill down and I can see all the different door styles that are in that file I can right click that copy it if I need to and right click my drawing and paste. Copy all those definitions in, leave the existing, and now they're all in. Now that they're all in, I can just select any one of those doors and change it from one style to another. And it changes it. Same thing applies with windows. And that's it. That's how you put in a door or a window inside a wall in AutoCAD Architecture 2016. Thanks for watching my screencast, and please don't forget to give me a thumbs up.